What's up, guys? So I came across an interesting comment when I was just kind of looking around social media, different channels, and um, this comment really stood out. Reading the comment, the lady puts here, I made a community post saying something similar, mad because biracials want to identify as just that, but then turn around and say they are not black. Which one is it? Now, the commenter here, I looked at her you know, profile picture. She does not appear to be biracial. Not 100% sure. She just looks like she's a, a black lady. But um, like the way she articulated this is spot on. This is literally the biracial dilemma, if I can say that, especially in regards to kind of our communication or if I can say our kind of connection, a lot of us with the African-American community because this is precisely how it plays out, right? When we want to kind of validate ourselves and affirm ourselves as being biracial, you know, we, you'll find out that a lot of African American people are kind of, uh, how should I say this? They are basically appalled at the fact that you are claiming to be biracial. They're kind of like upset about that. They're like, what do you think? You're better than me? No, I'm just honoring both of my parents. <laughs> I'm mixed. I'm dual heritage. I'm not just black. I'm partially black, but I'm also partially white. So I'm just as white as I am black. And um, yeah, but like she said, uh, the lady put here, a lot of people are mad at us when we affirm our biraciality. They take it like it's a insult or something like that. But the very same people who are mad at you for doing that, if you walk around and just be like, okay, then I'll, I just want to, you know, say that I'm black. So I don't make you guys upset, make your, you know, I don't hurt your guys' feelings. I'll just say I'm black. Okay. I'm a part of the family. You know, I'm fam, part of the hood. Those same exact people who got mad at you for saying you're biracial, <laughs> those same exact people, literally, they will turn around and tell you, well, you're not black. You need to stop saying you're black because you don't have the real black experience. You're not dark skin like me. You know, you're not from the hood like me. You don't have the same experience. And then, you know, it's so funny this lady puts this because this is really literally what we experience very, you know, often, a lot of us. And then she ends it by saying, which one is it, right? And I know it's funny. I've When I first heard that kind of uh, catch phrase, which one is it was from the uh, Exoticals United channel. When I first started coming, cro coming across um, mixed race content on YouTube, I came across Exotical United's channel and I asked her about that. You know, I like how you, you point that out. You say, which one is it? And she said she got that from Chrissy, who's a, a YouTuber, a, a black woman empowerment YouTuber. And she always uh, says, I guess, which one is it in regards to us? biracial people or mixed people, I should say. So I just found that to be interesting. You're right. Like that, which one is it? That catchphrase is really uh, interesting because it's like, you can't win. It's damned if you do, damned if you don't, this type of catch 22. And this is the biracial dilemma. So my whole solution is look guys, those of us who are black, white, mulatto, let's have a place where we can be validated, have a place of belonging and, you know, sort things out amongst ourselves. OK, there's many ways you can do that. I have a, you know, multiple methods. You know, you can do your private group chats. You can do private Facebook groups. You can do discord. You know, this social media, I mean, this uh, platform with YouTube, it's a public platform. So anybody can just, you know, comment. But uh, there, there's many ways you can network with people and create a, a space. And that's what I'm doing exactly. But um, this is what we see. Yeah, this is what we see. They're going to get mad when you say that you're a mulatto or multiracial. We're all mixed. There's no such thing as biracial. We're all mixed. As soon as you vote Republican, <laughs> you know, as soon as you disagree with those same people, they're going to be the first ones to tell you, well, you're not really black like me. You know, I have two black parents. It's just a different experience. It's like, yeah, you can't win. So don't play the game. I just wanted to kind of highlight this comment and share it with you guys. I know you guys have all experienced this as well. This is very common. Like I said, this is, you know, a typical, you know, biracial dilemma scenario. Hit the like button, post a comment and let's keep the conversation going.